Hey guys, it's Hero. The horse trade exploit is still viable, but you need a lot more horses to pull it off. I have alternatives. It looks like the fix that Tail Worlds implemented for the horse trade exploit, or horse trading in general, is to increase the gap between the buying and selling prices. It does make it harder to accomplish the exploit, but doesn't fix the issue. You can still exploit it, you just need more horses. A lot more horses. It may not be worth the time, or at least can't be done easily in the early game. We need another way. Enter the hardwood charcoal and the crafting materials exploits. These are the alternatives to the horse trading exploit. Let's start with hardwood and charcoal, since you can do this from the first few days of a playthrough. Looking at the weight of the two, hardwood weighs 10 units and charcoal only 5. For this reason, we can carry more charcoal at a lower weight, so we'll use that to lower the buying price of the hardwood. You can do it the other way around, but you'll need a lot of hardwood, and you could be moving slowly if you don't have the right perks to help you with that. The process is simple. In a town, sell all of the hardwood and complete the transaction. Then, go back into trade and balk the sale of your charcoal, which lowers the buying price of the hardwood. Buy all of the hardwood at the lower price, take back your charcoal, and complete the transaction. You just bought back your hardwood for less than you sold it for. Repeat this process as much as you want. I would recommend having about 150 hardwood and 300 charcoal to make this work nicely. Also, find towns that have a high selling price for hardwood. You'll get more money from them. Now let's look at the crafting materials. You don't need the masking steel. The other materials will work too. If you want to be efficient, carry the lowest quantity of crafting materials, use fine steel and themaskine steel only. 50 themaskine and 400 fine steel will work great. You can use the other materials too, but just these two is all you need. I'll show you why. Here the two materials have the same weight, so we will sell the more expensive themaskine steel, complete the transaction, go back into trade and balk the sale of the fine steel, which lowers the buying price of the other. Notice it only goes down so far, then doesn't go down any further. That is the lowest selling price of that material. This is why we only need 400 fine steel and none of the others. Now, buy all the Themaskine and take back your fine steel. If you're doing crafting orders, you may have a variety of all the materials. If that's the case, then you may not need 400 fine steel. You can use all the other materials to lower the Themaskine buying price. And to answer your next question, yes. We can use both hardwood and steel at the same time. Sell all of the hardwood and the masking steel, complete the transaction, balk the sale of both the charcoal and the fine steel, buy the hardwood and the masking, take back the coal and steel, rinse and repeat. I'll put together some data on using horses for the trade exploit and drop it in a follow-up video. For now, that's it. If I've missed anything, or if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching. Peace out.